Is there a right to publicly funded preschool in North Carolina? No, there's no constitutional requirement that we provide a preschool education. Uh, specifically, the Constitution does require us to provide a sound basic education, but it allows the State Board of Education, the Department of Public Instruction, and the General Assembly to establish exactly what that means. And uh, so that's what they've done through the laws and the regulations that they've created. But our Constitution contains nothing, no wording about a a right or a necessity to provide preschool education. A sound basic education, that's a pretty nebulous term that could be interpreted all sorts of different ways. Is that essentially what is going on here, trying to decide what that means? That's exactly right. And the origins of that uh, go back to uh, the Leandro case. And originally, this was a case brought against the state by some low-income counties uh, that wanted more money from the state. And uh, when it was found that they we're not going to be successful with what's called a, uh, a an adequacy uh, lawsuit or an equity, excuse me, an equity lawsuit that requires the state to provide an equal amount of funding for all school districts. They went to an adequacy lawsuit, which asked the question, is the state providing an adequate education for these counties? So the money issue was gone very early in the Leandro case, and it became an adequacy. And when it became an adequacy lawsuit, the question of a sound basic education was the central one, because that was the standard by which the court said, we will decide whether it's an adequate education by consideration of it being a sound basic education as defined by the courts.